Have you ever wondered about the diverse species of antelopes found in Africa? Africa, a continent known for its rich wildlife, is home to a vast array of antelope species, each with its own unique set of characteristics and adaptations. From the arid deserts to the lush savannas, these majestic creatures grace the African landscape with their presence, contributing significantly to its biodiversity. In this video, we'll be exploring five distinct species of African antelopes. The eland, the largest of them all and a true symbol of strength. The kudu, another large antelope known for its impressive horns and elegant stride. The adax, a desert dweller whose adaptations allow it to survive in some of the harshest conditions. The sable, recognized for its stunningly curved horns and lastly, the nyala, a medium-sized antelope native to southern Africa. So, gear up as we embark on this fascinating journey to learn about these majestic creatures. First in line we have the eland, the largest of all antelopes. This majestic creature, also known as Torotragus oryx, is an awe-inspiring sight with males standing up to 6 feet tall at the shoulder and tipping the scales at a whopping 2,000 pounds. Their light brown coats, sometimes adorned with white vertical stripes, allow them to blend seamlessly into their surroundings, a feature essential for survival in the wild. Elands have a robust build, with a humped shoulder and a dewlap, a loose flap of skin hanging down from the neck. The males sport impressive spiral horns that can grow up to four feet long. These horns are not just for show, they are used in dominance fights and as a defense against predators. The eland is unique among antelopes for its adaptability to different terrains. It is found across the vast savannas, semi-deserts and mountainous regions of Africa. Despite its massive size, the eland is an exceptional climber easily scaling steep rocky inclines. This ability to traverse various landscapes ensures the eland's survival in the diverse African terrains. One of the most fascinating aspects of the eland is its ability to maintain its body temperature within a remarkably stable range, regardless of the external environment. This thermal stability allows it to survive in both scorching heat and freezing cold, a testament to its adaptability. Elands also possess an uncanny knack for finding water in the most arid environments, they can detect water sources buried deep underground and will dig with their robust hooves until they reach their life-sustaining prize. This ability makes them a vital component of the ecosystem, as they often create water access points for other animals. Their diet is as diverse as their habitat, ranging from grass and leaves to fruits and tubers. This dietary flexibility further contributes to their adaptability and survival in various environments. Indeed, the eland is a testament to the grandeur of African wildlife. Its size, adaptability, and unique features make it a symbol of the rich biodiversity that Africa has to offer. This majestic creature truly embodies the resilience and beauty of the animal kingdom. Next up is the kudu, another large antelope native to Africa. In the vast landscapes of Africa, the kudu stands out with its refined elegance and distinctive physical traits. This large antelope species is primarily found in the eastern and southern parts of Africa, where it thrives in woodlands and hilly terrain. The kudu is split into two species, the greater kudu and the lesser kudu. The greater kudu is larger, with males standing up to 54 inches at the shoulder. The lesser kudu is slightly smaller, but both species share some striking characteristics that make them unique in the wilderness. Let's talk about those majestic spiral horns. They are a sight to behold, aren't they? The males of both species sport these impressive headpieces that can reach up to 72 inches on the greater kudu. These horns are not just for show, they play a vital role during mating season when male kudus engage in bouts of horn wrestling to establish dominance. But the kudu isn't just about brute strength, it's also known for its agility. When faced with rocky terrain or threats from predators, the kudu exhibits an incredible ability to leap with precision. In fact it can clear obstacles as high as 8 feet in a single bound. Speaking of threats, the kudu's striped body serves as a unique form of camouflage, helping it blend seamlessly into its surroundings. This, along with its acute sense of hearing, aids the kudu in evading predators and surviving in the wild. The kudu is also a social creature, typically found in small groups. However, during the dry season it's not uncommon to find larger herds gathered around water sources. This is a testament to their adaptability, a trait that helps them thrive in various habitats across Africa. From their majestic horns to their graceful agility, kudus embody the raw beauty and strength found in Africa's wilderness. They are a testament to the rich biodiversity of the continent and a symbol of the resilience of its wildlife. The kudu is indeed a symbol of strength and grace in the African wilderness. 
meet the Adax, an antelope that has made the desert its home. The Adax, also known as the White Antelope or the Screwhorn Antelope, is an extraordinary creature that has perfected the art of desert living. It's a remarkable sight to behold, with its long, twisted horns, a thick coat that changes color with the seasons, and a robust build that belies its graceful movements. This antelope is one of the few species that have adapted to life in the Sahara, one of the most formidable and expansive deserts in the world. What makes the Adax so unique is its ability to survive in such an inhospitable environment. They've evolved to be able to extract water from the plants they eat, reducing their need to drink, and with broad flat hooves they glide across the sandy terrain, much like a snowshoe prevents a hiker from sinking into the snow. The Adax's coat is a marvel of nature's design. During the winter months it sports a thick gray-brown coat that helps it retain heat. But as summer rolls around this coat is shed, revealing a white layer underneath that reflects the harsh desert sun, helping the Adax stay cool. But the Adax's most distinctive feature has to be its horns. Both males and females sport these impressive spiraled appendages, which can grow up to three feet long. These not only serve as a means of defense but also act as a status symbol within their social groups. Unfortunately, the Adax is a rare sight these days, their numbers dwindling due to uncontrolled hunting and habitat loss. But efforts are underway to protect this desert dweller. Conservation programs aim to reintroduce the Adax to its native habitats, and strict hunting regulations are being enforced to protect the remaining populations. The Adax is a true survivor, thriving in the harshest conditions. Its story is one of resilience and adaptation, a testament to the incredible diversity and tenacity of life on our planet. Now let's turn our attention to the sable, known for its impressive curved horns. The sable antelope, scientific name Hippotragus niger, is a striking creature easily recognized by its robust build and incredibly long curved horns. The males, or bulls, stand out with their dark, almost black coat, while the females, or cows, sport a lighter, chestnut color. These majestic creatures can reach up to four and a half feet tall at the shoulder, and their horns, the crowning glory, can extend up to five feet long. Residing primarily in the woodlands and grasslands of East Africa, the sable is an animal that prefers the cover of vegetation. This environment not only provides ample food sources but also offers protection from predators. But don't be fooled, the sable is far from a pushover. Armed with those formidable horns, they are known for their defensive prowess. When threatened, they don't run, they stand their ground and fight, often forming a line with others in their herd. Those long curved horns aren't just for show, they can be lethal weapons. One unique feature of the sable is its social behavior. They form herds that can number up to 30 individuals, led by a dominant bull. This social structure strengthens their defensive strategies and ensures the safety of the entire group. The sable is indeed a sight to behold in the African landscape. Last but not least we have the Niala, a medium-sized antelope native to southern Africa. A sight to behold, the Niala boasts a distinctive coat, a compelling blend of gray, brown and white, adorned with vertical white stripes that form an elegant pattern. The males, distinguishable by their spiraled horns and shaggy dark brown to gray coats, are larger and more striking than the females, who sport a reddish-brown coat with no horns. The Niala makes its home in the thickets of southern Africa's woodlands and forests, where it enjoys a diet of leaves, fruits, and grass. Its preference for dense cover makes it a bit elusive, but its graceful movements and striking coat make it a sight worth waiting for. One of the Niala's most fascinating features is its peaceful nature. Unlike other antelope species, the Niala prefers to avoid conflict. Instead of locking horns in physical combat, males perform a unique lateral display to their rivals, a dance of sorts where they show off their size and impressive horns. This distinctive behavior is a testament to the Nyala's preference for peace over conflict, a trait that sets it apart in the animal kingdom. The Nyala's unique combination of elegance, peaceful nature, and distinctive physical features make it a fascinating member of the antelope family. As we wrap up our exploration of these magnificent creatures, let's take a moment to appreciate the Nyala, a beautiful testament to the diversity of antelope species in Africa.